Welcome to a hell video. I have an hypnotic background so it will be easier to uh, absorb this material that I'm about to present. Note, do not like or dislike this video. It is pointless because there is something or someone that is changing that in the background remove some likes it will never the, the likes and dislikes will never do anything to to my videos if you appreciate what I do you need to comment if you if you don't like what I do you also need to comment because I'm not going to um, have any conclusion from the uh, likes versus dislikes so you simply has you simply have to to leave a comment um, okay hell let's talk about hell a bit I just realized I missed adding something uh, a few things I will add it to the to the end of this presentation just like that and um, Let's talk and let's have this hypnotic background so that you fall asleep listening to my words and, and uh, seamlessly what I say will sink into your um, um, unconscious, you see. It will be absorbed there and, and, and we're, going to, we're going to have some, uh, some fun here now. We're going to talk a bit about hell. What is hell? Is it bad? Is it good? It's obviously a bad word, and uh, but I, for a very long time I have been uh, seeing this symbolism or whatever you want to call it that it's not that bad, okay? But you know, or 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 maybe even it is um, it is the complete opposite. But who knows, guys? Who knows? Um, what's interesting is that there is still this play on. On the opposite symbology I can still show you this and if you th if you are if you feel like hell is bad I'm going to make you feel that even better even more I mean uh, but I am uh, personally I'm more um, careful of what I think what I believe and but I'm still going to show it to you because you deserve to know it and I can present it so why not why not guys so hell there's a place called hell Where is this place? Uh, this place... Someone just decided... Hell, hell! Like, uh, and uh, it's, it's centered around a sawmill. A sawmill! For, for uh, yeah, that's hell, you know? And where is this hell, uh, you ask? Where is it? Where is hell? Where is hell, guys? Can you guess? Is the hypnotic background uh, doing what it's supposed to do? Well, is it? Hell is uh, a few miles from Detroit in uh, Michigan. And um, this wonderful place is in the Livingstone County for the Livingstone you know the Livingstone the Livingstone and hell is at the same place I find it very fascinating hell Livingstone same place but in, in the Bible you have the Livingstone and a living stone rejected by man but in the sight of God chosen and precious 
you yourself living uh, like living stones are being built up as a spiritual house to be a holy priesthood to offer spiritual sacrifices acceptable to God through Jesus Christ for it stands in scripture behold I am laying in Zion a stone a cornerstone chosen and precious and whoever believes in him will not be put into shame The stone that the builders rejected has become the cornerstone. The cornerstone is one of the names of Jesus Christ. It's one of the names because the cornerstone is... Yeah. This, this living stone, you know, what is a living stone? Well, for example, um, a blood coral. A blood coral is a living stone. Well, guys, I don't want to go off subject here. What are we talking about? We're talking about hell. We're talking about a living stone and hell at the same place. Uh, superposition of the both. One in, one in front of the other, you see. And there, there are more of these living stones in the Bible. And the living stone is limestone, as I said many times. And also you can see some hell symbolism because the first Baphomet statue was first revealed in Detroit, you know. And um, the largest limestone quarry, you know, I, 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 I believe that this, or I argue for this living stone to be um, limestone and so the largest limestone quarry in the world world is is um, in Michigan, so it's, it's it's same place, same place. But uh, and that's why that's why the world's biggest Masonic temple. You see, what do you think about Freemasonry? Oh, oh, do you remember Freemason? Free comes from freestone, which is a limestone. So the largest Freemasonic temple is in Detroit, you see. That's probably if you want to apply logic because sometimes you can do, do that also. It's not it's not uh, against the rules to use logic. It just sometimes doesn't get you anywhere. So um, you know, they use the limestone to build the temple, so maybe that's why it's the biggest in the world, you know. But from another perspective, it's the biggest in the world because Detroit and Michigan is, is a significant place. But you know, yeah. So, I just find it very amazing, amazing that this hell you have living stone and then all the bible verses you see about living stone and and you and i both know or some of you know that it is um, limestone and it's quite obvious at this time um you have another place called hell let's into let, let's let, let's look into that this place this is also called hell. It is. It is. Um, hell in Grand Cayman Island. Or something. You see? Oh, you see? Limestone formations. Hell. Hell. Oh, we see that the hell is in the limestone. You see? But, but, but I, 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 who am I? I don't like uh, argument out of authority, but I'm going to just share my opinion. You don't have to call it as my authority, like it's just my opinion, okay? Um, as a researcher in this, I do not see the limestone itself as hell, 
but you know when you look at the limestone you want to see it oh that looks grotesque it's hell you see that's the hell no in my opinion it's not the the hell is the light that goes into the into the limestone and uh, yeah Yeah, and and uh, I have more opinions. You know, my opinions is also that this uh, light into the limestone that is the keys, uh, the keys of heaven, the the keys of heaven and hell. You see, it's it's the keys to to those doors, and um, yeah, so some stuff about hell you 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 uh, you think that's that's cool right you, you uh, that's uh, Detroit stuff again I'm talking about Detroit here um, and hypnotic music it should be able to sink in this stuff um, I'm, I'm taking some help of this background you see the hypnotic background oh you see you see this background? You see? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no, no. Don't look. Don't look. Don't listen to it. You see? You see? And as I said, do not... Of course you can like or whatever, but what I'm trying to say is that it's kind of pointless. I am... I am definitely shadow band or something I, I I do believe so and it is uh, it's kind of pointless to to like um, it's better if you leave a comment and say like in the comment or something you see it's uh, because I am I, I, I believe that I will be able to not have the censoring as long as I can add you to the list of approved users um, and uh, yeah, uh, so this is so fascinating, guys, because there's no other place like this. There's no other place like Detroit and this, um, all the stuff around this. And, uh, and it's so fascinating that the hell is inside the living stone. You see, oh, you, you you see, because hell goes into living stone. You see, the the county of of uh, hell goes into as a little as a little uh, stigmata or something. Can we call it that? Is that okay? Stigma, stigmata. Because when something is stigmatized, or when something is astigmatized, it's a vision error. You have bad vision if you are astigmatized. So when you are stigmatized, you uh, can see properly and you can see the light. But you are also gaslighted. You see, you're gaslighted and you shine with a limelight. You see, the limelight from the limestone or, or the quick lime. You see? Um, you see, guys? Some stuff, some... I, I hope the hypnotic background did what it's supposed to do because I'm going to end this video now. And I hope you uh, got the point of this. See you guys another time. Bye-bye.